surprise, little video. Um, ¿Qué me recuerdo más de usted? Me recuerdo estando usted uh, como ocho meses de embarazada de Rafael, viviendo en Riverside y terca que siempre usted limpiando la yarda. Y ahí andaba atrás, ¿se acuerda de esa yarda? Qué grande estuvo en el frente. Y there you are, mowing, cortando el zacate. Ocho meses de embarazada. Y lo hizo toda sola porque flojo de hijos que teníamos o que tenía. Um, y después, en cuanto terminó su cortada de la yarda y del zacate y la limpieza, se sentó en una silla y con un sabor se tomó una cerveza. Fría la cerveza que me acuerdo. Um, y feliz. Porque usted siempre está feliz en la yarda. So, eso es una memoria uh, bonita que tengo de usted. Y bueno, hay varias memorias, ama. Pero lo que le quiero decir en este video es que tanto la queremos. Y el ejemplo que usted nos ha dado de fuerza, de cómo sobrevivir las cosas que a veces pasan en la vida. Y usted ha sido ese ejemplo para nosotros, que siempre hay otro día, hay una mañana. Y a veces no creo que usted lo, lo piensa igual. Y bueno, así es. Yo de tan inteligente se me cortó el video. Pero quiero terminar en diciéndole que usted es fuerte, usted es maravillosa y la queremos muchísimo. Y feliz día de las madres. ¡Muah! Hi mom. Bueno mom, son muchísimos los recuerdos que tengo contigo. Sería muy difícil solo escoger uno. Más que nada quiero que sepas lo mucho que te agradezco todo lo que has hecho por mí, todo lo que has hecho por Ricardo, por siempre apoyarme y por siempre estar a mi lado. Te quiero mucho. Feliz día de las madres y te mando un besote. ¡Mua! Hi Connie, uh, it's me, your son. I was told by your oldest daughter to make this video longer. So, 12 seconds, 13 seconds, 14 seconds, 16 seconds. Uh, a memory of you is... Uh, I'm making a video, Carmen. Um, I have so many, they're all wonderful. Thank you, Mom, for being a great person. Testing one, two, three, testing one, two, three. So I don't have a specific memory, but rather I want to talk about 
how memorable it's been to uh, have this garden uh, and have my mom uh, help me out uh, almost every single step. She's been involved in every single aspect of it. Um, and whilst we were working on it, she would uh, remember uh, what it was like to grow back, to grow up in the village um, and to grow food with her, um, her dad, uh, our grandfather, obviously. And um, I think that's really cool. And I, I look forward to always having this point of reference and these set of memories. And um, they say that nothing's ever really lost to us as long as we remember it. And there we go. Um, memories make us who we are. And this is a, definitely a good bunch of them. So uh, love you lots and happy Mother's Day. Hi, Mom. Uh, <laughs> remember when we were uh, uh, at Malaga two days ago and I ran into the into the apartment complex and I'm like, and I'm like, you know, take off my pants, you know, and I'm trying to take off my pants and, and then you were pulling them off and because I thought I had a spider <laughs> that fit me uh, in the, uh, like, like, I thought I had a black widow, you know, in, in my pants and, uh, and we all laughed at me <laughs> you know uh, and I just thought that was really funny um, but anyways um, I ma uh, um, I love you mom you you you've given all your kids just um, just unbelievable love and, uh, and and you know these years have been really good for you and I'm so proud of you mom and so I just I just pray uh, I pray to God that just uh, everything keeps going forward and that you stay healthy or you you uh, you know hit that exercise and you know you stay in our lives as long as possible mom and um, you know there's some some new things in my life and uh, here is Elijah saying hi brushing his teeth at uh, at five at five thirty, and I just wanted to say hi. Say hi, Bobby. Say hi. <laughs> okay, mom, we love you. Okay. Mom, happy Mother's Day. Hi Connie, happy Mother's Day. I hope you have a fantastic day. Uh, my fondest memory is probably us dancing at our wedding hmm. or sweating in the spaghetti for the first meal that you made for me. That was, and then you laughing about it. Actually, both of you get laughing at me. Um, one of the things I've learned from you is how good you are at keeping such a big family so tight-knit and uh, so well-connected and uh, love you very much. Happy Mother's Day. Mom, one of my favorite memories, <laughs> it's actually a funny one, me, you, uh, Rafa, and Carlos were driving, I think we were going to the mall or something, I can't really remember, but uh, in front of the bank, it said free checking, and you thought it said free chicken. <laughs> and you were really excited about it, and it was really cute, and we just, we still laugh about it. Um, I don't think I'll ever forget that moment. I don't think any of us will. Um, I just want to take a minute to let you know that I love you, that you're very special to me, and through you I've learned to be strong and independent, and to, um, really just put one another first, you know, family's everything. And um, I know it's difficult for you sometimes, 
you know, having having to raise six crazy kids, but you did it. So thank you. I appreciate you. I love you, and I hope that you have a beautiful day. Love you. Happy Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day. Feliz Día de las Madres, Consuelo, quería decirle que la quería mucho y que una de las memorias muy bonitas que tengo de usted es cuando fuimos a Dallas y que andábamos tomándonos fotos y que andábamos corriendo en la lluvia y, y usted para donde sea nos seguía la onda y pues para decirle que la quiero mucho y que uh, le mando un abrazo muy fuerte. Bye. Happy Mother's Day, Grandma Cello. Say bye. Bye. All right, so what Nana has taught me is to always go forward, uh, no matter how life is, what it throws at you, uh, how complicated it might get. You just keep pushing forward, keep keep striving for better. Uh, and if you keep doing that one day, it, it'll do pretty good for yourself. Uh, and then my favorite memory with Nana uh, is when I was a kid, jumping on that trampoline, almost hanging myself and falling, and then her cradling my arms, crying, like, are you okay, are you okay, and just be like, we have a bond here. You care if I if I if I die from this horrible trampoline. Um, but yeah, I have a lot of great memories of Nana, and I cherish all of them. But that's the one that uh, really stands out to me. So happy Mother's Day! I love you very much, Nana. You mean the world to me, um, and I hope that you have a great day. Happy Mother's Day, Nana. You are an incredible person who has taught me to not be afraid to work hard for what I have and to be grateful for what I do have because I know from your stories from growing up in Mexico to where you are now, the hard work you've put in and to always know that what we have today is thanks to your hard work and the hard work of our parents. So you've shown me that and I'm really blessed to have you as my Nana. You're such a giving person, and I love you so much for being there, especially, this isn't my favorite memory, but it is a memory that sticks out a lot, is you coming to my graduation in Texas, even though I know how much you hate to fly, and I can't imagine what that was like for you being uh, put on a plane, but you did it, and you did it for me, and uh, I'm incredibly, incredibly grateful, and I love you so much. And you've taught me that above all, family is most important and you are like the center of our family whenever we go to Fresno. It's, it's your house that everyone comes to and I love that. So I hope you have a wonderful Mother's Day. Love you, Nana. Happy birthday, Nana! I love you. I hope you have a beautiful birthday. My favorite memory with you, my favorite thing to do with you is when we cook. I love cooking with you and I love talking about all your stories that you have to tell me. I love listening to you. And I miss you so much. 
and I really want to give you a really big hug and a really big kiss but I'm far away <laughs> and I hope you have a beautiful birthday and I can't wait to see you soon Bye. I meant Mother's Day <laughs>